All right. Hello, Scorpio. And welcome to your horoscope. Um, it's never too late to be loving. I mean, this is going to be the last full-on week of Jupiter in your first house in the real strong sense. Um, Venus is there. Venus is going to be playing with you for a long time, Scorpio. <laughs> like she isn't already. <laughs> Well, I mean, Friday looks very romantic for, for the get-go today. You know, it's looking good. Like, you know, your relationship, Venus rule, nakshatra, all that stuff. It's like, mmm, juiciness, yeah. Feeling that juicy Scorpio vibe. Oh, gosh, thank you. Thank you, you know. Thank you for the love. You know, that. You know, once again, that gratitude thing is so powerful. Um, people want to hang out with you right now. I mean, you, you really got it going on good. And you will for the next couple weeks. Um, Okay, so uh, you're restless about where you live. There's a lot more movement than there's been for a while for you. So a little bit of travel. Um, you're appreciating your children and your art projects as something to be a catalyst for spiritual activity. Um, relationships intensify this weekend to some extent. So there's a little bit of an intensity. But you know, you'll have your intuitive thinking cap on. And, you know, we got to have compassion for people when we go through this type of stuff. Um, you know, you're really hungry for a good work position. Also, there's kind of a sense of fame that's coming towards you as well. And um, it's important just not to get caught up in the ego or be part of your own undoing this week. With that sun and Mercury transiting, pay attention to your dreams. They really do mean something. And... Uh, Follow suit. Move on. Move forward, forward, forward. Okay.